find the LCM and HCF of 20, 30 and 45. To find the HCF and LCM, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. That is C. 20, 30, 45. Okay, next. Now here we have 20. 20 is 5 4 20. Now 4 is 2 2 is 4. Now 2 is a prime number so we take 2 1 is 2. Now here we have 30. 30 is 5 6 30. Now 6 is 2 3 6. Now 3 is a prime number so we take 3 1 is 3. Now here we have 45, 45 is 5 nines 45, 9 is 3 3 is 9, now 3 is a prime number so we take 3 1 is 3. So now our HCF is, HCF is the product of numbers that should be present here and here and also here. So now we should find the numbers that should be present here and here and also here. I repeat, we should find the numbers that should be present here and here and also here. So let us find. Starting with the number 5. Do we have 5 here? Yes. So next place, do we have 5 here? Yes. So you cut 5 right here. Next number is 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So next place, do we have 2 here? No. Okay. So go to the next number 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. But 2 we don't have in the next place. So no more numbers are left. Therefore, only one number, 5, is present in all the three places. So it is our HCF. I repeat, only one number 5 is present in all the three places. So this is our HCF. Now to get LCM. To the number that you got as HCF, to that number we should multiply by certain numbers. How do we decide those numbers? C. Here 5 is cut, leave it. Here 2, two we have. Do we have next place? Do we have 2 here? Yes. So you cut 2 right here. Now next number is 2. Do we have 2 here? No. Next place. Do we have 2 here? No. Still you cut 2 right here. Now here 3 is not cut. Do we have 3 here? Yes. So you cut 3 right here. Now here 3 is not cut, so you cut 3 and write here. Now each num number has been cut. Therefore, you multiply these numbers, whatever number you get, that is your LCM. So let us multiply. That is 5 into 2, 10, 10 into 2, 20, 20 into 3, 60, 60 into 3, 180. So this is our LCM and this is our HCF. Am I clear?